So in the case of a rapid deployment, two guys, two peapods, one pickup truck. So basically, we unload it here. Watch how quickly we set it up. All we do is we take the pin out, locking pin from the back, we lift the unit up, we line up the holes, locking pins in place. Now you can see that we have a centered design here with these locking pins inside. You put a lock through there, there's no way it can collapse when in use. Also, we have the 40 gallon toilet here, which is removable from the back. So it gives you a center design, which allows for more room for the end user. I don't have a toilet paper dispenser in my face, nor do I have a urinal in my elbow. So it's also, you can see how bright it is because of translucence. And also we can see that we have engineered venting here. Well, we have ventilation directly from the rear of the storage tank, such that this tank can be removed and swapped out. It does have forklift grooves. I know it's empty now, so this is a bit easier for one. But essentially what you can do is swap out the tanks and either empty it from behind, put in a clean one, or you can transport this if you have a forklift without spillage. To get it back in, we simply center it, slide it in, replace the pin, we're good to go. The other thing we should note is that we do have holes such that you can put your um, grounding spikes into the dirt so that it doesn't move. The other very cool thing about this is we can drop this in a second. So if wind comes up or when we want to uh, move the units, we simply remove the pins, we drop the unit, we put the locking pins back in place, we're good to load her up again.